You know these guys already. Kostub, pro kayaker, Limka Book of Records holder, and in love with the sea. Shanjali, psycho junkie, adventure junkie, and a master planner. But then, even the best laid plans of mice and men often go awry. Some such, some such. So what do they do? Give up? Not when you're on an epic 3,300 kilometer journey from Kutch to Kanyakumari on land and sea. Together, they will conquer the coast. Why would anyone brave the endless sea? The sun, the dust, the smog of Indian roads? Tall waves that want to hug you? Well, not the way you want. And stretches of road that are only as divine as they're deceitful and deadly. It's beautiful. Hey, wait, it's not even touched it. It's still the top of the But it's not even touched. It's not touched. It's touching. But then, when have crazy people ever needed any more reason than simply being crazy? Yeah, Kostup, I'm looking at you. But hey, there is more to it than what meets your eye. Water, water everywhere, not a drop to drink. But you can definitely make new friends. Yes, in the middle of the freaking ocean. Thank you. Blistering barnacles, humans, they're just everywhere. Look at that uncle throwing his fishing line. Gives you serious chill goals in life, doesn't he? And these random aunties only wanting to wish a perfect stranger good luck. Inspiring, I tell you. Look at this kid. His expression alone could convince you to get kayaking. Oh, oh maybe not. You find food. More food, different food. And in the strangest places, some peace. You meet new people, discover new cultures, and learn new things. Look at this charmer, entertaining the entire village with his stories. What are you saying, Costa? <laughs> So why do people go on adventure? The thrill, the adrenaline, the people, the amusing cultural shocks, the stories you get to be part of? Yeah, yeah, all of that, yes. But then, when you're conquering the coast, you kinda sorta also get to make people dance to your tunes. Check this out. All right, all right. I know that wasn't the fox trot, but we did promise you a music video, right? Wow, Kostub, how clever are we? But guys, all these people you meet, what leaves the most impact? I think it was warmth. Yeah, whether it was in Porbandar, where someone on a pretext of chai served us a five-course meal. Or it was rainy and stormy in Kerala, and this fisherman literally dragged me out of the water, uh, took me to his house and gave me a hot meal and a towel. Or the cops, who are <laughs> always ready with a warm welcome. <laughs> true, true. So guys, what are you planning for the next episode? A Kelly Ladki on an Anjan Sunsan road. What? What did you say? Sorry bro, that's all the time we have in this episode. Until the next one. Oh, come on. Oh, so kadam bamba,